Hey there everybody, I'm Z, and I'm here to talk to you about why Call of Duty has failed in the last few years. Um, I just got off of playing a multiplayer game, uh, and I just it just bugs me. Um, I'm not a fanboy, I'm not anything like that, I'm not like some of the kids that will probably not like what I'm going to say, but I used to play ever since 4, uh, pretty much got off when, what is it, uh, Black Ops 2 ended. I tried uh, Warfare 3, and uh, yeah, that's pretty much my experience with it, uh, is after Warfare 3, I played a little bit of the other games on other friends' stuff and computers and stuff, but I didn't like it. I didn't like them at all. So I decided to give a chance to uh, Black Ops 4. Uh, a friend actually got me Black Ops 4. He said, yo, you got to play this, you know, all this stuff. Uh, Blackout's okay. Uh, Zombies is great. Uh, multiplayer is super under par in my opinion to this game um one of the biggest problems and issues i see is the equipment and operators uh they didn't really need to add operators uh too much but i guess you need to add operators when you don't have very much of a story uh for that you're gonna be hearing me go uh a lot because it's it's really a mind buster when you've grown up with these games and you've seen them kind of not sticking to some of the old stuff, bringing in, you know, the gradual new stuff, making it, you know, so that both both sides could have, you know, the conjoined thing. That's that's the thing I'm looking for is that formula from back then just with new stuff, new weapons, new things. Uh, sure, you can have operators, but do them right to where you can kind of have it your own way. Um, there's a lot of balancing issues where they nerf more than they buff. That's another thing that they tend to do with the, these Call of Duty games that I, I really dislike. Um, I liked being able to choose my own weapon, uh, you know, any weapon, and still do good with it against anyone else. You know what I mean? Uh, balancing that way is just completely terrible now. Um, another thing is the matchmaking is, is completely off. You, you get matched with people that are so much higher, but so... So better than you, it's ridiculous. It's like you don't have that medium ground, you, and you can't really just play with friends and stuff because you're always in like what it feels like a league match. Um, but yeah, no, uh, I'm gonna be mixing some some clips in here with uh, blackout and things like that. So don't be surprised if if you see that as well. Uh, anyways, getting back on the subject of balancing. Um, one of the old game, one of the things the old games have that I really liked was, uh, equipment you could just use right off the bat. Like, uh, instantly any, every single round, like, I know you're, you're gonna probably, people are probably not gonna say, but, but the grenade spam, well, grenade spam had counters such as trophy system, things like that, which were pretty good. I remember when they had a standing trophy system, that was hilarious, I loved it. Um, but no, like, they have, they have trophy systems you could use, so if you were more of a, uh, a team player, which is kind of rare now because... You know, that you don't really have very much. It's Call of Duty, you know? And, like, when playing Search and Destroy, here's a big thing about the team. The team would usually tell you which side it's in. Now it just shows you in, like, red where it is. And now you have no help with team, whatever. You don't even need team, which is which is good but bad. Because, I mean, there goes a big poor part of, part of, like, the old game where you could make friends doing that. And they tell you or type it in chat. But, going back to what I was saying, I'm rambling. Uh, yeah. So, like, I liked having the equipment at the beginning. That's all gone. You can't just bomb a, t bomb a, a dumbass that's running out of spawn instantly. You, you can't do that. Or you can't set up the spawns to where grenades don't instantly do it like they did back in the day. Now it's literally you have to be lucky with your connection, be lucky with your shots, be lucky with all that. Or, you know, just be accurate as possible. However, like... You can't get a single headshot. It's usually a double headshot. If you have potty armor, it's even worse. And that's that's a whole different story right there. Even potty armor. Why is that a thing in multiplayer? Like Blackout, I understand. I, I don't understand in multiplayer. It completely defeats the whole purpose of everything. Like, this is just me ranting. I, I, this is going to be most of the video. What would I think? This is most of my opinion. But this is why I think it failed. Is because the old players are trying to come back to play it. And it's not... It's it's just a fucking fuck fest. I have 150 health. What? 150? What is this? It, it, usually the normal person has 100, right? This is. What is this? And and with body armor, that that's it's so weird. It's just uh, 
I feel like there's a lot of balancing issues when it comes to this sort of stuff. They, they just threw things up against the board. They're just like, it's a Call of Duty game. Anyone will buy it. They're doing this constantly. Like, they're only focusing on, on the two game modes that I think are new and, well, not new. The Zombies isn't new, but it's it's a simple formula, and they're keeping it. That's what I mean. Why don't they do that for the regular game? And that's my point. Like, keep the formula the same, switch it up a little bit to where, you know, new guns, new things, uh... Stop with the whole operator thing. The operator equipment you can't even use. It has to charge. Everything's a cooldown. I, it feels like I'm playing a MOBA sometimes. <laughs> like, uh, it's it's bad. Um, Map design, you know, they're bringing some of the old maps in. They have some of the old maps in there, which are pretty good. I haven't seen any of the new maps. Or not any of the new maps. Any of the, like, uh, old maps from, like, way back. But they have uh, firing range and things like that, but... The new maps I'm kind of okay with. I need to get used to them. That That's understandable, but... Like, even score streaks, uh, score streaks are a little bit harder to get. But, I mean, everything... If you tap a guy and, another, and your teammate kills him, it still counts as your kill, too. I guess that still gives you, like, incentive and still gives you a lot more points. But, like, I remember when, like, you get three kills and you get, oh, hey, you that's a kill streak, so that means you get a, uh, a UAV. Now it's, like, five kills for a UAV. But, I mean, you don't actually have to kill the guy. Do you see where, like, the the old doesn't really mix with the new, in my opinion? Like, that's, that's like, what I'm saying is the biggest problem with Call of Duty now. Um, you may be hearing my fan also in the background there. I see going, but, uh, yeah, like, I apologize for the background noise. But, yeah, I, I really think they need help. They need to buff all the weapons so that they do more damage. Uh, they need to add equipment for everybody at every beginning of the round. Um... I think this whole squad stuff, this this whole operator thing, I, I mean, is, is kind of fugly. Uh, you can't use their equipment instantly either. I feel like you should you should be spawning with the equipment. Why the fuck does your operator not have his own equipment? I mean, special, I understand. The Q is fine. Q, Q needs to gain to get kills to get, which is fine. Like, that's good. I like that. But your equipment itself should spawn with you. Like, Torx doesn't spawn there. Um, who else doesn't spawn with theirs? Um... Sensor dart, so that's recon. Recon doesn't st spawn with his. Uh, Seraph doesn't spawn with hers, I think. Uh, this is all with search and destroy and stuff, too. Um, like the other game modes. Uh, who else doesn't spawn with theirs? Uh, I don't think... Yeah, that's 9-bang. Uh, Ajax doesn't spawn with his. And uh, who's the last guy? Uh, the dog guy. I know who that is. Ruin doesn't spawn with his, I don't think either, but I'm trying to remember the last guy. But anyways, you get my gist. Like, there's, there's, it's not fun. It's literally a grind fest when you're trying to do, get do stuff. You know, I mean, I wanna, I wanna trick somebody with my equipment. I wanna trick them out, but I can only use my equipment once in a great while, or once in a while. This, this is what I'm talking about. Like, this is, this takes away the, the, the avenues and like the surprise of the game. Don't even get me started on kill cams at the end. They're all random. Like, the guy that gets two kills will get the kill cam rather than the guy that gets three kills. But, you know, that's that's all point-based, I guess. I don't know. It's not really cool. It's not really... I mean, I, I throwing axe two guys, and the guy next to me gets two kills, but it goes to him instead of me. I, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> so, yeah, that's, that's my biggest problem with the multiplayer is that... Um... Oh, man... Some of the some of the running around, some of the pacing is is really off as well. Um, sliding, I don't mind. They can slide. Um, if I had equipment, I could just dink them or something, which which would be cool. And they would slide right into like barbed wire. This is what I mean. Like it's once again, I'm going to torque with his his barbed wire. Like if he instantly has it, you could have more abilities and more things with it. Like I said, I think they should have it. I think every single one of them one should have one right at the right at the beginning, right at the beginning. And then when they die, they either get it back or. I, this is where the whole, uh, like, cooldown shit is kind of fucked, because I don't get it. I don't get why they would have, have cooldowns. Like, I think Torque should only be able to put down two barbed wire at a time, so that's fine. But everyone should be able to use their abilities as much as they want, like, their main abilities, not their ultimate. That can, that can tick up by killing, that's fine. A little bit faster than what it's at right now for, like, Seraph and, uh, Recon, but Recon and Seraphs are really OP, so I understand that. However, it's it's super annoying not to be able to do cool kills or anything like that in game. So, 
yeah that's just my opinion on it so far um i don't know if i'll be talking about black or anything i don't really do this that often i just want to get my opinion out there so uh yeah thanks for listening and uh have a great rest of the day and uh, i guess like or something i don't fucking know you don't have to subscribe or anything i'm not one of those normal youtube guys i'm really not i'm not looking for anything from this video but uh yeah have a good one i'll just play it until about 10 10 30 there it is